Hello, boss. Hi, how are you guys doing? Hilma Daniel here. Welcome to my channel. Welcome to my channel. This is a channel where we discuss productive stuffs. If you are, you know, coming across us for the very first time, please do subscribe. Watch the rest of the videos. There's quite a lot of videos on the channel. And if you are a returning subscriber, well, thank you very much for your continued support. We highly appreciate it. Okay, so today I want to discuss the 50-50 type of situation. 50-50 yeah? type of situation. I'm scrolling on my WhatsApp and I'm coming across this lady and she's saying, women who go 50-50 with men, um, women who go 50-50 with men, uh, how do you even get turned on by these guys? Well, I can't do it, you know. And um, first of all, I want to, you know, um, drop something here. Ne? I want to drop something here and I want to say that um, when you have a mentality of that you cannot do 50-50 with a man, ne? you are not ready for marriage, you are not ready for relationships, you are not ready for love, you are not ready to be loved. Ne? You are not, that is my personal opinion. It can differ from other people, but this is what I think. Ne? When two people come together, when two adults come together, you need to understand one thing. This man is not your father. This man is not your father. He is your boyfriend. And in future, when you become a wife, he is your husband. But he is not your father. Your father can provide for you because he is your, your father. You are his child. This man, you... Two adults coming together, you are not children, you are not babies. First of all, men, come here, let's talk. Ne? Dear women, I'm done with you. Men, come here, let's talk. I need to talk to you as my sons. And let me tell you one thing. Stay away from a woman that says she cannot do 50-50. Stay away from a woman that says she cannot do 50 50. she cannot bring a part of something to the table well let me tell you one thing when you are looking for a son for a woman because it look, you guys are our sons we are the ones giving birth to you but it looks like we are not teaching you when you are looking for a woman you are looking for a grown-up woman you are looking for a matured woman you are not looking for a baby to raise you are looking for a matured woman that comes to the table and say, we are coming together to grow our future for our children. Bring yourself together, but you are not coming here to look after a woman completely. You are not coming here to take care of a woman. You are coming to the table to say, look, I am looking for a helper. I am looking for a lover. I am looking for a woman to love for the rest of my life. I am looking for a mother of my children. That should be the mentality. Eh? And I am looking for the love of my life. Ne? When you get a woman, you want a woman that is going to stick by you in good days and in those bad days. If you are doing good and you are, for example, a businessman, and then one day your business comes crumbling on the ground. This woman who is saying, I don't do 50-50, is going to run away from you. That is not what you want, my son. Be wise. Be walk. Do not let women confuse you. They must not confuse you. Those ones that don't want to be 50-50, let them be single. Let them find people that, uh, that are okay with that scenario. But let me give you my my advice stay away from such people if you want a partner in life this is what you want as a man while you are you you deserve to be loved just as much as you are 
loving your family. This is what you want. On those days where you know um, you are feeling down, where you know your car broke down, where you know and you don't have money, this is what you want from your wife. You want, oh, baby, um, let me say for instance, you are such a supporting man. You know, I just put down a video on a man who's very supportive and what you should be in a marriage. You know? Go and watch it. Now, I am with my husband and my husband is so supportive and he's so a provider. Yeah? And um, me as a wife, she, my husband pays for the house and everything and everything. This is me as a wife. Once in a while, I would want to say like, okay, fine. Let me see what's in the kitchen. There are probably no good food. Let me order proper food so that at least I make sure that I'm on top of my game. And you're not going to do that with a woman who's just busy doing nails and, 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 and. If your car broke down now and you need money and your money is finished because you have taken care of us, me as your helper, you want a woman that says, oh, baby, so your, your car broke down. You know, in those days where you come home and you're like, oh, Neman, I'm stressed. Um, my car broke down and, um, you know, um, I've ran out of cash. You want a woman that says, oh, so you've ran out of cash. Here, baby, take my card. Take specific amount of money, um, fix your, 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 your problem, and then we move forward. You do not want to, you have a problem, you are down on the ground, and uh, madame is just busy doing my, the nails. I don't do 50-50, but you are suffering. On those days where you know your business is not go doing good, or you lose your job, or something happens to you, you want a woman that comes in the picture and say, hey, okay, sorry, my dear, why are you coming out? Hmm? You want those, um, that woman that goes like, okay, so baby, uh, it's okay, I got this. Pick yourself up. I shall pay for the bond while you pick yourself up. I will put petrol in the car while you pick yourself up. I shall get the cosmetics while you pick yourself up. You do not need a woman that's going to be like, oh, so you're on the ground. Ooh, me, I'm out. I can suffer with you. I can do 50-50. So be very careful of these women with this mentality. They are going to abuse you. You do not want to grow old with a woman with that mentality. You know what, I, I, I really caution you men to say that uh, be careful how you choose your woman. A woman is a very lovely person. But if you choose wrong, you are going to regret it for the rest of your life. A woman, a good woman is a beautiful woman. But the moment you get yourself a bad woman, you are going to regret it for the rest of your life. Of course, no relationship is perfect, but choose a good woman for yourself. You know, I keep uh, speaking about this so proudly because I had somebody that was very, very close to me. May he so rest in peace. I loved him very much. Um, um, how do I say this story with respect? The original wife passed on. Luckily, the kids were grown, married in the houses or working. And he got himself a second wife. I've never seen him um, talk about death so much. You know? um, every now and then he would be like, ah, I want to go to heaven. Every now and then he's like, I want to, I want to go. I want to go to my wife, I want to go to what, what I want to go. Every time I visited him, he was like, I want to go, you know. Um, he got a, a second wife, and the second wife was not a good wife, you know. Um, hence, when, when I tell you this, you know, and I loved him very, very much. He, he was very, very dear to my heart. Um, yeah. And he was such a good person, so kind-hearted, and you know, he made a wrong choice. 
of a woman. The woman is beautiful. She looks good. She's very beautiful. Stay away from those slay queens, my brothers and my sons. Stay away. If a woman have a choice, you have a choice to be either a woman of good order or to be a slay queen. It's a choice. Stay away from those women. They are going to abuse you. They don't care. They're after money. They're after materials. Leave them alone. Look for decent women. Look for decent women. A woman, it, it's okay for a woman to be boring than to be wise and woke and to be a know-it-all. That was a very beautiful woman, good-looking, but unfortunately not a wifey material. I've never seen him suffering. To a point where one day we went to visit him and... Um, he just came from the hospital. It was morning time and we came around about four. That person drinking medication, he did not eat anything from morning time until around about four o'clock. The only thing that that person had was Takwe Arola. And I've never been so angry at that woman. And I was so young. There's nothing you can do. And I remember when, when, my, when, he passed, when he passed on, we went for the funeral, and you know, this woman like showing us off. Hey, they are so cute like they are. They are so beautiful like they are. Now she's just like showing us off. And then that woman sent me. She sent me. She sent me something. Please uh, go and get me something. I just said, Ewa. I went, I never came back. That is how much I was angry at that woman. She sent me and she said, uh, go and get me what was like, okay, ma'am. I went, I never came back. I was like, I'm not being sent by you, my dear. I'm not interested in being sent by you. And I'm not bringing what you sent to me. I did not answer it, but I just disappeared. I never came back. I was like, I'm not taking that. I'm very, very not happy with her, you know? So when, when I tell you, um, choose a woman wisely, choose a woman very wisely. And I'm going to repeat this for you. Do not allow yourself to grow too big without getting yourself a wife. Ne? Uh, marriage is not prison, my sons. Ne? The people that are telling you marriage is prison are those people that have lost purpose in life. You can still live and come to your beautiful home. The, the kids bring so much happiness in you. Do not live without a purpose. Yeah? When you have something to provide for, you grow, rather than when you just have money and you've got no direction. And good women, they they direct you in, in a beautiful path. Ne? God, 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 God created a man and a, a woman for a reason. This is your helper. They help you make good decisions in life and they just help you grow. Ne? When you really get yourself a good woman, you have, you, you have scored yourself some good points. You are going to grow. You are going to have beautiful children. You are going to be a happy man. You just have to be a man of good order. Okay, so do not walk around picking women that are saying 50-50. There are those women that are still in good, in, in good order. Look for those ones. Search for those ones. Leave these ones of 50-50. As my son, as a child, I wouldn't advise you as a man to go for women that do not believe in 50-50. Go for women that have got purposes. Go for women that have got... Um, 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 Plans that go for women that are you know, having their life figured out, but not a woman that does not believe in 50-50. Go for a woman that goes like, oh, so baby, you are paying for our bond. You are taking care of everything, but I also have money. Let me, let me, let me multiply our assets. Let me buy another house there. Let us rent it out. Money comes. You finish buying it off. You put it in one of your son's names. You buy another house. You, the debt rent coming from then, this salary, you multiply it, you pay it fast. Get, when you leave this earth, you have, you know, um, uh, you know, gotten, uh, build wealth for your kids, for your grandkids, for your what, and then you push the same hard work to your children and your generation is never going to suffer. Get, get brilliant women. 
get women that are on top of their game that are like aha so baby we are in this together we are going to do this together not not the type of a woman that because you are a hard worker you, you are just and also when you get more money in life remain humble my sons remain humble money have the power to either make you or to break you if you are not thinking wisely and you've got a lot of money it might break you let me leave you with that one that is it from me Hilma Daniel I will see you guys in my next video if this was a beautiful video if this was educative please do share do comment and do um like ne I will see you guys in my next video that's it from me bye bye